going guys it's your boy lieutenant dan here with another falcons film breakdown today i wanted to break down some of how an actual play uh, a read is made by an nfl quarterback especially with matt ryan versus the carolina panthers this is actually the second pass that matt ryan has in the game and i kind of just wanted to do a little read and, and and show you what matt ryan was looking at and why he made the throw that he he made so uh with that being said i hope you enjoy the breakdown and i will see you guys at the end of the video on this play here, Matt Ryan is trying to diagnose what the defense is giving him. At first, it looks like a simple blitz that may potentially come off the left-hand side against Jake Matthews and James Carpenter. As the play uh, develops, though, and as the defense begins to settle into what they are actually wanting to show Ryan, Ryan sees the blitzers come down. So he knows that either one of these two guys here at the bottom half is going to step off and take on the responsibility of the slot. Or one of the blitzers from his left-hand side where they were initially showing coverage is actually a zone guy. As the play develops though, Ryan sees the safety come over to play a man-to-man -man with that slot. He knows that this left-hand side here is a faux blitz. Um, it's There's no aggression coming from those guys. They're literally standing there. The only thing now that Ryan has to figure out is are they going to bring somebody over to Julio or are they going to double uh, Russell Gage on the outside? As he runs the play, you see Luke Keekley drop off. Ryan already knew this was going to happen, but what he was keying on was 97. 97 begins to drop off in a zone coverage over where Julio Jones is supposed to be. Ryan immediately identifies that his guy on the outside is a wide open target, five yards in between him and uh, this corner here and he sees the safety drop over near to Julio Jones leading to Russell Gage getting this reception it's again a simple read and react to what the safeties are look are looking to give you and and honestly all it took was Ryan to see that this edge drops off the safety drops towards the middle of the field which leaves the outside of the field vulnerable to an inside attack boom and straight in for a first down so I just want to thank you guys for coming through. I hope you enjoyed that little uh, that little showing of what the Atlanta Falcons were looking to do against the Carolina Panthers. And if you like this type of film breakdown, something short, sweet, simple to the point, just showing plays and how they developed, um, I'll do more of them for you guys and on more players, different types of players, uh, depending on what you guys want to see. Hit me up in the comments section and let me know what you liked about this video or what you didn't like about this video. Uh, because we're trying to test some things to see uh, what the general audience wants to see. Uh, just more straight plays being uh, uh, done or uh, more things like this where we break down where everybody goes and where there are openings in defense or openings in offense that we can attack. So um, anyway, my name's Lieutenant Dan. This was Unintentional Groundings. Falcons film breakdown of Matt Ryan versus the Carolina Panthers. One particular play. We'll go over many more uh, as the week continues. Um, and depending on whether or not you guys like this type of video, we might just do a big one that rounds up all the best plays. Um, again, my name is Lieutenant Dan, it's Unintentional Grounding, film breakdown of the uh, Matt Ryan versus the Carolina Panthers. Peace, hair grease.